beautiful breeze. Oh, look, here's Anne. Um, oh, historical. I think this might be there. A lonesome dove, maybe. Yep. So here is Boss Eckhard. Real life cattle man. That's very cool, isn't it? How cool is that? I like someone's put bandanas around there. Oh, and some money. That's so cool. There's two um, two people here. They, ins they inspired the film, the TV series Lonesome Dove. Born a slave in Mississippi, Bo's Icard came to Texas as a child with the family of his owner, Dr. Milton L. Icard. He remained as an employee of Dr. Icard following his emancipation, but in 1866 joined a cattle drive to Colorado led by Charles Goodnight. I love that name. And Oliver Loving. Oh, that's so cool. I knew there was Goodnight, but Icard came to became one of the good knight's best cowboys and trusted friend following his work in the cattle drives eichard settled in weatherford he and his wife angeline were the parents of six children when he died in 1929 at the age of 85. good knight had a granite marker erected at his grave 1990. very cool i mean how it seems like a little feather in there Oh, we should put, I'll put, we should have some change in here. Yeah. I love the, like, bandanas around there. There we go. There we go, sir. So cool. I remember watching Lose and Dove back in the days when I was a kid. I might seem cheap, but I don't really have, I have pennies. <laughs> yeah, sorry, did you take credit cards? <laughs> sorry. Okay, bye, boss. Boss. I like you can see the Weatherford in there, the Weatherford Town Hall in the background. Very cool. So I'm, I'm from England, so if I pronounce anyone's name wrong, I apologize in advance. No, there should be another one like that somewhere. There's probably that over there. That's going to be the other. I think like Legends of the Old West is like so quality, especially come from England. I mean, it's like a different, completely. Different to what we know. There it is, Oliver Loving's grave. My apologies. My apologies. How cool is this? This is nuts. The Dean of Texas Trail Drivers, Oliver Loving. Founder of three major cattle trails, Oliver Loving came to came from Kentucky to the te to Texas in 1845 and to Parker County in about 1855. During the Civil War, he supplied beef to the Confederate forces with Charles Goodnight as partner 
As partner on a drive to New Mexico, Loving scouted ahead of the cattle, was badly wounded by Indians, lay five days without food before his, before his rescue, and he died of gangrene on September the 25th, 1867. His dying wish was, to, was fulfilled when his son Joseph joined Goodnight to bring the body 600 miles by wagon for a burial in, his, in this con county. I apologize. Sorry, my mouth's really dried up because it's hot, so I can actually read. <laughs> you just can't read, I just but... can't read. My, my lips are so parched. See, this one's even got I am. That's 600 miles. Back then. Have a look at some of these. I think it's so cool that people put these um that little grave for an over. People put these bandanas on here. Citizen of the Republic of Texas. Hey guys, that was the lonesome dove.